The Adventures of Jimmy Neutron, boy genius. Bolby Stroganovsky. Among the weirdest characters in Jimmy Neutron is Bolby Stroganovsky, who's more of a product of his time than anything else. A burger, fries, and shake kebab. I'm just saying, a guy who's basically a bunch of weird foreign stereotypes in a blender being called an unknown species by a literal alien might not fly by today's standards. Regardless of the ethics, you can't deny that the slap, 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 clap, clap, clap song is a masterpiece like no other. Slap, 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 clap, clap. Many brains, few morals. It's easy to forget for a kid's show, Jimmy Neutron had very few morally upright characters. Even Jimmy himself wasn't safe from this, given how many times his inventions nearly destroyed the world or even qualified as crimes against humanity. Remember the episode where he made Sheen a literal megamind god of destruction? You dare to honor me? Carl's interest in Jimmy's mom. If there's one running gag in Jimmy Neutron that everyone remembers, it has to be Carl Weezer's constant infatuation with Jimmy's mom, Judy Neutron. It can be as innocent as serenading her after throwing a brick through her window, or as downright creepy as having her shrunk down and put in a jar. Hi, Mrs. Neutron. Those of us who have had our minds completely destroyed by meme culture are probably more disturbed by the latter. An interesting sponsor. In the special episode, Win, Lose, and Kaboom, Boom, host Meldar shouts out his sponsor, which happens to be Tentacle Lubricant. Seems like someone's been watching the more unsavory types of anime, or some really weird SpongeBob SquarePants fanfiction. I won't judge. Hugh and Judy in general. Refreshingly enough, Hugh and Judy Neutron are actually a rare victory as far as cartoon parents go. They're genuinely supportive, mostly responsible people who love their son and each other. And believe me, they really love each other. Hugh, you're, you're so shiny. Yeah, you like what you see, baby? One of those games. There's one scene in particular where they allude to one of those special games, one that involves Hugh wearing spandex. You spandex? I get it. You want to play one of those uh, special games, eh? Hey, whatever keeps things exciting for you two. The banana. And of course, we can't forget Hugh's famous line from his long-winded story. Once when I was seven years old, I sat on a banana. And of course, that changed my life. Maybe Timmy can give Jimmy a reference to his therapist. 